What is going on my fellow YouTubers? Sergeant R6 here bringing you another episode. It is 27 degrees right now. It is January 1st. It's cold as fuck. She almost didn't start, but she did. I got her. Oh fuck, I gotta turn here. I am out running some errands. And I don't really have any fucking cold weather gear. So I'm just rocking my uh <laughs> my summertime mesh jacket with about six fucking layers on. Excuse me while I do this real quick. Alright. Yeah. Alright, so I hope everybody has a safe and happy Christmas and New Year's. Uh, I sure did. I just went out with a couple friends, had a couple drinks, had some good times. It was fun. want to talk to you guys about is dealing with trolls or I guess really people who leave nasty comments that claim they are good people but yet all they do is they shut other people down whether they really mean it or not It's annoying, especially when it affects your life personally. There are people that I'm not directly associated with. Well, I, I mean, I, I am associated with them, but I've never actually met them. They live in my area, and they commented on a picture... I'm not going to get into any more, much more detail than that. But they commented on a picture. You know what? I'm going to wait until I start moving it because it's got to be fucking boring as shit. Just sitting here watching me fucking talk to the camera and you watch me. Okay. See you in a minute. Blah! All right. So I'm back. So I'm talking about the people who hide behind their keyboards, make nasty fucking comments. They'll never say anything to your face. But they'll... What really gets me is when somebody, like what, this isn't the first time with these people either. First time somebody posted something, it was just downright rude and inappropriate. And it was on something that I posted, that I have never met, I've never talked to, I have never directly associated with this person so there is no reason whatsoever why they should have put anything on something of mine now I responded to that by deleting their post and sending them a private message saying please do not comment on my stuff you don't know me, I don't know you, I would greatly appreciate it if you kept your comments to yourself. I never heard from this person, again. Not, I mean, I, I never got a message from them, I haven't seen any, any, other, any other posts or anything like that. Now, a few days ago, a similar situation, a picture was posted, and another person from this group, again, said something nasty and disrespectful and very inappropriate that comment was deleted shortly thereafter it was posted not by me or the person who posted the picture but by the person who posted the comment and if you're gonna have the fucking balls to post a goddamn comment leave it up there you don't fucking back out at the last second if you're gonna back out of the fucking post in your comment then don't fucking post it at all 
Holy shit, I'm getting angry. Because that shit pisses me off. These people, they don't understand. They don't know the whole fucking situation. So there is no goddamn reason at all in the world for them to be posting anything at all. And they don't see the situation that I'm in. I've never done anything to these fucking people. I've never said one goddamn word to them. I've never badmouthed them in any sort of way. And yet they're basically trashing me. That is not fucking acceptable. Nobody should ever stand for that shit or deal for or deal with that shit, period. The audacity that fucking people have. And these people claim that they're, you know, I guess I really don't know what the fuck they claim. But they... Ah. These people are faithful religious people who follow the Bible, which says, you know, to be good. The Bible teaches good things. And yet, these people are trashing somebody else in a situation or a couple people for this matter in a situation situation that they know nothing about so where the fuck do they get off by doing this shit what do they accomplish they accomplish nothing they accomplish somebody who had absolutely no who had absolutely nothing against these people and now they have instilled an impression on me about who the fuck they are because I've never met these people I don't know who they were so I'm not going to pass judgment I've never had any reason to pass judgment against these people but now I do now that that, it has basically become a personal attack against me and what and what the situation that I'm in that shit is not gonna fly I don't give a fuck who you think you are but I know exactly who I am and who I'm not gonna be dealing with and I'm not gonna be dealing with the fucking shitheads like you who wanna post bullshit comments and then back out of it at the last fucking minute and not stand behind your fucking ground but that's not what this is about this is about the fact that you fucking posted the goddamn comment in the first place. If you're gonna post something negative, make sure you know the whole fucking story. Make sure you know everything about the situation that's going on. And then pass your fucking judgment. Do not hide behind your fucking keyboard or somebody else just because you are going off a of hearsay. Um, and what, whatever else you might be gathering just from outside fucking sources. Know the whole story. Do your research. Figure out what exactly is going on on both sides of the argument. Because just doing this shit one-sided does not accomplish anything. You actually end up hurting yourself. All right, you guys. I um, I hope you've enjoyed this. <laughs> I got a little angry today, as I do when people will just decide to be plain fucking idiots. Anyway, again, I hope you guys had a wonderful holiday season. I am so glad it is over. Finally, work will calm down for me. I can relax a little bit and you know enjoy some time. But uh, ride safe, stay warm, anybody who lives in the north, and I will see you later. Peace!